What's up everyone and welcome back to my channel. Happy Friday. My name is Olivia and today we are tackling an all day entire apartment clean with me. It's gonna be jam packed with a ton of cleaning motivation and I know after you watch today's video, it will make you wanna get up and get cleaning. If you guys are excited, then as always, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, hit that red subscribe button down below and let's get started. Today I'm starting in the living room because I just couldn't stand looking at our messy couch for another second. I wanted to rotate some of the cushions and then fluff all the pillows and fold up the blanket. I also noticed the coffee table had some crumbs and stuff on it, so I wanted to make sure I wiped that off completely before I vacuumed. Before we get too far into today's video, I am so excited to share that I've partnered up with my good friend Hope and her YouTube channel here is At Home With Hope. You can also find her over on Instagram, but she shares a lot of similar content to mine. So I know if you enjoy watching my videos, then you will love hers as well. Whenever I need some serious motivation to clean, she is one of my go-tos because she does it all. Hope is also sharing an all day clean with me over on her channel. So when you're done watching my video, make sure to head over there, check out her channel, check out her video, make sure to subscribe and then let her know I sent you. finish up this living room space, I just went ahead and vacuumed up the couch cushions to pick up any crumbs and then I moved over to the floor and rug. But up next, this wouldn't be an all day clean with me if there wasn't some laundry motivation. So before we get any farther, I'm going to toss in a load so that it has time to wash while I get some other tasks done. And I'm really curious to know if any of you guys are on a laundry schedule. Like how many loads do you do per day? Do you even do laundry every day? What's your schedule look like? Let me know down below in the comments. As I moved over to the kitchen, I was kind of cleaning things up a bit and putting them away. And I went to put our crock pot and toaster back where they belong. And I noticed the toaster had left quite a bit of crumbs and it's been a while since I last cleaned them up. So I'm just gonna take my Dyson with the um, brush attachment just to kind of suck everything up so I can put the appliances away. I saw the city passing by my window. Was in the crowd, but I felt so alone. My phone like every other second. My future was blurry and numb. Now it's time to wipe off our kitchen counters, and today I'm just using this good smelling cleaning spray. If you guys watched last Saturday's video, then you'll likely get that, but if not, I'll just fill you in really quick. So last week, my husband Marshall filmed an entire cleaning video completely by himself, and he even did the majority of the voiceover. And when he was cleaning off the kitchen counters, he had no clue what brand or scent it was that he was using. So he chose to say the good smelling cleaning stuff and it just makes me laugh when I think about it. But anyways, he shared that video last Saturday. So if you guys haven't watched it yet, definitely do so. I'll have it linked up here in the cards as well as down below in the description box. And even if you don't get any cleaning motivation from that video, it's definitely worth the watch because it sure is entertaining. And for those of you who have already watched it, I just wanna say an extra special thank you because Every single comment left on that video was just so nice and genuine and Marshall and I loved going through them. So thank you. One thing that Marshall and I are usually really good about is taking out the trash regularly because we do live in a small apartment right now and I just hate smelling it or seeing it piled up because obviously we're in a small apartment so it's just right there. But 
Every once in a while, it does get out of control like this specific day and I just needed to do something about it. So once I removed the bag of trash that was in there, I went ahead and sprayed it all down with my method degreaser spray just to kind of wipe everything down, especially the inside. Since we only have ever lived in an apartment together, we have to have our trash can out in the open because we don't have any like pull out drawers or really any space for one. And so I do my absolute best to keep it clean and looking nice. remember it how you turn everything around I will always remember it how you got me off the battleground how you got me off the So at the beginning of this year, I'm not sure if any of you remember, but I randomly sent out some Starbucks gift card to you guys for supporting my channel, basically subscribing, watching my videos, commenting, giving it a thumbs up. And it's just something I wanted to do more of throughout the year. And to be honest, this year has flown by. I cannot believe April is almost over, but it's something I wanted to do again today. So all you have to do is make sure you are subscribed to my channel and then comment down below. You can comment whatever you want. Just make sure to put a thumbs up emoji in your comment just so that I know you entered. And I will randomly pick a couple of you to send a $5 Starbucks gift card to. I will be picking the winners the same day and I'll respond back to your comment asking for your email just to send the gift card over. It's just a small way for me to give back and say thank you. He comes around, but I'm not that step down. Come a little bit closer. Yeah, yeah. Come a little bit closer. Yeah. To all my ladies who got a brother that doesn't treat them right Put your finger right in his face and tell that man bye-bye I'm too fly, I'm too fly Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye-bye You're a little bit selfish You get mad every time you lose You can't take me with you I'm scared you're gonna blow your fuse Come a little bit closer Yeah I can really start over Yeah In the back of my mind There's someone waiting on me You're just wasting my time Because you're scared and lonely Finally got some closure Yeah I can finally start over For quite a while, I was using the Mrs. Meyers cream cleanser on my stovetop and I loved it, but I was on the hunt for quite a while to find an actual stovetop cleaner. And I picked this one up at my local home goods and it works so, so good. The brand is Wyman, I believe it's pronounced, and it was only a few dollars and it works like a charm. A million people in the crowd, but I only see your face in all the lights. And as the bass keep pounding on me.
Almost always I use my Dyson to vacuum up any dirt and crumbs from the kitchen floor just because it's super easy and convenient. But today there was just so many crumbs and stuff and they were under the cupboards. I really just wanted to make sure I got everything up. So I decided to break out my broom and really sweep under the stove, the fridge, all of the cupboards first because I am gonna be swiffering the floors and I just wanted to make sure everything was picked up and everything was clean. I just realized we are a little over halfway through today's video and I have not yet introduced myself to any of you guys that are new around here or might be coming over from Hope's channel. So I just wanna say welcome. My name is Olivia and I am married to my wonderful husband, Marshall. We've been together over eight years now and we just got married last July and I seriously love him more than anything in this world. He is amazing. Uh, but we live in Minnesota and I don't see that changing anytime soon. We are currently renting an apartment and we would love to buy a home. Um, that was the initial plan. We were gonna rent for another year and then buy a home. But the prices are just way too high right now, so we're gonna continue to save until the time is right. And besides YouTube and Instagram, I also work a full-time corporate job. And I've been working from home for the last year or so, so I've been doing my best to balance both worlds. It's just a lot of work, but I wouldn't change a thing about it. I absolutely love what I do. Uh, here on YouTube, I share two new videos every week related to cleaning, organizing, decluttering, decorating, and also a little bit of lifestyle every now and then. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, I would love it if you would stick around and subscribe. And if you are new, I would also love it if you guys would comment down below and say hi, and also let me know where you're watching from. I pull into your driveway, it's a Saturday night You look like a million bucks wearing that dress I like You're smiling but there's something missing in your eyes Girl, I can tell that you have something I went ahead and switched out the loads of laundry and now I'm in the bedroom because there are quite a few things in here that need to be done. First off, our bed is a mess and I need to get that made. Normally I wash my sheets on Sundays and Wednesdays or maybe Thursdays during the week, but this Sunday, the day that I'm filming this, I had full intentions to self tan later that night. So I didn't wanna have fresh clean sheets and then crawl into bed with self tanner. So I decided to hold off. I ended up not self tanning until later in the week, so I definitely could have washed them, but it is what it is, I guess. Here's some more laundry motivation for you guys. So after I got our bed made, I went ahead and put all of the clean clothes that I just pulled out of the dryer on top of our bed, just to make it easier so I could get them folded, hung up and put away. And I will say, since I shampooed our carpets a few weeks ago and I saw how dirty it was, I've been really trying not to put our clean clothes on the floor if I can avoid it. And if you guys have been around for a while, you know that if I had no motivation to fold, I would always just start a mountain of laundry on the floor and eventually get to it. But now I have been really tossing it on our bed right away and then folding it before we go to bed if I don't have the motivation to fold it right as I take it out of the dryer.
vacuum lines are the best thing ever and I just love when our bedroom is picked up, the bed is nicely made and the carpet is freshly vacuumed. So right now I'm just gonna quickly wrap that up and then we're gonna head into the bathroom. The bathroom doesn't need too much work, but of course I need to put away all my stuff that's on the vanity. And I got a really good kick out of Marshall when he was filming the video for last Saturday. He kind of picked up my makeup bag, looked into the camera and like shook his head because he knows that I struggle with this area. And it's funny because he like never leaves everything, anything out in the bathroom. I don't know what it is because he can leave his socks in the living room or like dishes on his nightstand, but his bathroom stuff, always gets put back when he's done using it. So I don't know what it is, but it's like the complete opposite for me. Anyways, another project that I've been wanting to tackle in the bathroom is to clean out this linen closet again. It's become quite the mess and I've been, I've been just kind of throwing things in here and I really do regret it because it's just a disaster now. So the next day that I get a lot of motivation, I'm gonna try to tackle it. I shared this with you guys before when it kind of first came in, but I'm not kidding. Everyone needs to run and go buy this tub scrubber. I hated cleaning out our shower and tub area because it just required a lot of scrubbing and effort. But this tub scrubber that I found on Amazon was only $13 and it has been a lifesaver. This is not sponsored whatsoever. I bought it with my own money and I'm just so glad that it actually works. I'm excited to share that with you. So I've been using it, I wanna say once or twice a week just to kind of keep up on our tub and it has been the best thing ever. So I will have it linked down below in my Amazon storefront in case you guys are interested. Holding back, I got history. All right, you guys, that is gonna wrap up this all day entire apartment clean with me. I really hope today's video gave you a ton of cleaning motivation to get up and get cleaning. Don't forget to comment down below for your chance to win a Starbucks gift card. Make sure you guys are subscribed and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Also, make sure to head over to Hope's channel and show her some love and support. I will have all of her information linked down below in my description box. Like I said earlier, she is also sharing an all day clean with me for double the motivation but anyways, I hope you guys have a great weekend and I will see you all back here very soon. Bye.